first car was almost not worth mentioning, but um, I had a Celica. <laughs> I got it from my cousin. I actually had to open the driver's door with a coat hanger from the passenger side. My first car was a 1991 Ford Escort station wagon that we nicknamed the Puddle Hopper. That's way better than mine. <laughs> I, I drive a Porsche Cayenne. No, I'm joking. <laughs> I just bought an 82 Datsun 280ZX on eBay. I went backwards, yeah. It's a, it's a silly car. It's not backwards, I think it's forward. It's forward thinking. <laughs> yeah. I was working at a pizza place called CeCe's Pizza and got my first paycheck and I went out and bought um, Joe Cocker. Nice. Yeah. It was a, a cassette tape and I would like put it on play and go to sleep listening to You are so beautiful. <laughs> Me. <laughs> My mom gave me the White Album by the Beatles when I was nine. Set a really high precedence <laughs> yeah. for Thanks what for a band could be. <laughs> upstaging me. Appreciate that. Um, the last record that I've gotten really obsessed with was Devanger Van Hart's Mala. It's incredible. The first concert I went to was um, <laughs> it was live in Counting Crows. With Amazing. my 16 year old girlfriend, and we held each other while I alone loved you. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. My first concert was White Zombie. And uh, who was the op wow. The opener was Filter. Sick. And I remember uh, distinctly smelling marijuana smoke for the first time. I said, What is that smell? Yeah, upstaging me again, man. No. Killing my stories. <laughs> Ooh, we went to that Neil Young concert oh, the other day. that was incredible. Insane. One of the best ever. My first was right here. I got it when I was uh, 17 from a prison guard. <laughs> nice. Seriously. <laughs> In his living room. Love to hear the backstory on that one. Well, okay, so my, my buddy, Jamie, we were, you know, when we were like 15, 16, we started hanging out with his older brother and all his buddies who were all prison guards because they stayed up all night playing Dungeons and Dragons and they would buy us bottles of liquor. So that they, doesn't sound very prison guardish. They were disobeying the laws <laughs> in terms of underage drinking and giving tattoos to minors. <laughs> but they were nice dudes. I just got this one in Germany a couple weeks ago. It's my Mayan birth symbol. <laughs> vacations when I was a kid. We didn't do vacations. We weren't financially family. stable enough for vacations. We, we did a vacation called Let's Move Into Grandma's House. <laughs> it was a tearful vacation. It, it lasted two years. 